So, we're uh, trying to work uh, KAR on the uh, new uh, Super Fox mode of FT8. And uh, you can see the uh, WSJTX uh, screen here in the background. I'll get myself out of the way. We're on 15 meters. Interestingly enough, I'm not on my hex beam. My hex beam is picking up a lot of noise, and I could never decode K8R. But on my off center fed dipole, I am. Uh, so I am uh, transmitting uh, about 400 watts uh, to the off center fed dipole in the chance that we might be able to get through. A lot of folks working. We have to get into a queue here. You can hear the multi tone uh, signal of the. Uh, uh, Super Fox signal FT8. These are the other stations calling. Oops, and I totally dropped out the Not sure why. So this uh, silent period here is when I am transmitting. I did work uh, K8R on uh, 20 meters a couple of days ago. That was my uh, first Super Fox. Uh, and uh, I will say you have to download the version 2.7.0 Release Candidate 5 WSJTX uh, version. Um, I had some other versions. It may have been my installation, uh, but anyway, I know this version works. I don't have the gain of my hex beam here with the uh, off-center fed uh, dipole, but at least I'm able to decode it. There we are. As I understand it, he can work nine stations at uh, once, and you have to get into a queue uh, he was receiving me, I guess, at minus three. What's well, that's perfectly acceptable. All right, and I got an R R seventy three. So that was uh, an FT8 QSO using the Super Fox mode. Notice it dropped out um, in, in, for transmit. And, uh, so yeah, I'm pretty happy about that one. Uh, so we're going to try to work him again later on 10 meters if we can hear him. But we got him on 15. Yay! Thanks for watching. 73, y'all.